Hello and welcome back to City Bus Manager and here we are once again with our company Dave Coach operating in Swansea. So let's have a look and see what is going on first things first. So it's 10 in the morning on a Monday. Are we going to be able to manage to carry our 198,230 passengers in one day today? And are we going to be able to ensure fewer shift cancellations of um, zero in four days? We're currently at six. Well, that one's a no, because I think we need to we have a cancellation within the last three days, so that's going to keep roll o rolling over. It'll be another rollover, but oh well. But we have a chance with these 198,000. We're currently at 58,375, so that's like 140,000 more to go. We have a fair amount more time to go. We have also been getting a few lovely offers for some of our buses, so let's see what we have in here. Has anyone given us a good offer? Office, offer. Sorry, I'm using all kinds of offers, officer, offer the word, but no, just any good offers. So Christoph has given us a good offer. Yes, bus for you, bus for you, Stefan, um, and a bus for you, John. And there we go. Money is rolling in. Happy days. Do we have any broken buses while we're in here? We're going to keep an eye on our buses to keep them happy for the shift station one. But they all seem to be good for the moment. Those three in there are just ones that we have for sale. Do we need any more replacement parts? I will buy a few more of the ones that we need to have roughly 10 of each in stock. Okay, and then let's assign that one still strange sometimes that it doesn't seem to uh, assign straight away but i suppose it is what it is um, i don't know why it's not on the list of routes for assigning but it does look like we have no buses available in here which will be able to do it so let's see do we have a bus available in our second depot out at clanelli I ideally would love a um, if we can no you are busy um, do we have any of these who are available I would ideally like a double decker but that doesn't seem to be possible we should have one in here that should be available because it's given us the option to click on it and have it ready for allocation. So where is... Oh, interesting. I thought there was a bus in here. Do we have a U? No, no. No, 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 no. Hmm. Let's put a bit of speed on this and let's go back and check our, our first depot. There should be a bus somewhere in here. Shout out if you see one with a green green box round that is available. As at the moment, this seems to be non-existent. There are no buses to take it. Weird. Maybe I allocated the bus already to one of the others without realising it. Hmm. Oh, well. Let's leave that for now. We'll come back and sort that in a moment. Anyway, what we wanted to do in today's episode was to build a bit another office down here so we can then put in more lockers and get more staff. As our drivers are getting a bit pressed. But first things first, that I'm going to do is just put in a few more bays. We'll just fill in down here and over there, and then we'll get onto the building in just a second. Okay, so that has a few more bays. We have 11 seconds to try and find a bus in here that is operational. We have a couple here. That is good. Do we have a double decker anywhere? Yes, we do. Off you go. I want that driver running as quick as he can 
Do we have any broken buses? We have a few offers in here. It's a yes for you. So Evo, you can have that bus, but Chloe, no, you can't. So do we have any brokens in here? Yes, we do. We need you getting repaired. It's just a wiper. We'll do your brake pads while we're at it. For sale, for sale. And then these two as well in the depot. Need a bit of work. It looks like we just have a few, a few lights that need a bit of work. There we go. All good. All getting sorted out. You need to get cleaned and washed and fueled. And then we need to get you painted up as you are going to be in the City Midi 1 category. Happy days. Looks like it's just you two left to be sold. Oop, new offer. Are anyone offering goodness in here? Nope, and it's a nope. So, nope, nope. Okay. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to start putting in this new building over here so we can have our office put in. So let's start off doing that and I'll come back in a bit. Okay, so construction will start with a nice little corridor across here, doors at both ends and a row of lockers. Happy days. That's already a good start. I'm going to do two little bathrooms, one on each end. And instead of doing our usual double bathroom where you can sit on the toilet and watch your colleague on the other side do, do his business, we have to go for two individual ones, one on either side. Of course, some nice plants to make it pretty, but we'll also do a nice kitchen in the middle, putting lots of fridges and vending machines in there, so hopefully people can find food and not be queuing up too much. And then obviously you need some more lockers so we can get some more staff in a moment. Just working really hard and having it all nice and even on both sides, because obviously symmetry is the key to making people happy, or one of the things that make me very happy. Anyway, here we go. That's an office started. We'll get filling it in. Okay, that's got a start on our office and stuff over here. Just thought we'd have another quick check at our buses. We have a nice offer from Martina on the double decker, so you can take that one. And we do actually have quite a few new broken buses in here. So let's see what we can do with all of these guys. Rush through and just Top them up with whatever they need as quickly as possible. Okay, so that now has all of those guys sorted out. We are closing in steadily on our 198,000. It's 9.40, Monday afternoon, or Monday evening now I suppose. And we just need another 36,000. Could actually be hard pushed to do it at this point. Maybe we'll get there very soon, but I'm beginning to doubt it for now. Anyway, let's keep going over here. Put in some more windows, I think. Let in the natural light. Okay, I know this area down the end here has not been filled in yet, but we'll fill this in at another time. It's probably not very exciting watching me do yet another bit of office space. But we have a nice start. We've got some nice cantini tables set up, some seating areas, some bookshelves, some boards for pinning on work notices, some toilets so people can all go do their poos together. And then everyone can squeeze in here and get food out of the fridges and stuff to share around where everyone's storing their lunches. My prediction now is we're going to fail on this 198,230. It's just gone 9 o'clock and we are still only at 174, 175 basically thousand people. So, once again let's check on broken buses. Anyone new in here? I don't think they, they shouldn't really be, not like we've had that much time. But that said, you are a new broken bus. And as are you. Oh, 
an engine has gone. Oh, better get you fixed, actually, properly fix you. There we go. Any sale offers? Nope, nothing there. Do we have any buses in here that need a quick lick of paint? Other than you, I don't think there is. I find it interesting that you haven't been picked up by the auto auto stuff, because you really shouldn't have been auto cleaned and stuff by this point. Anyway, there we go. Happy days. Money has rolled in fairly well. It's not been the most profitable day. We're only at 297,000. But then I suppose we have spent 113,000, it looks like, on building our new office and corridor. So, it is what it is. There's still a chance for us to make a bit more money. If we're looking back over here onto the Friday, it does look like we did have a 407,000 profit. And that should hopefully have had ticket counts high enough to get this sorted out. I mean, we are 139% up on the Sunday, which is nice to know. Uh, mostly it looks like in single tickets, those have both gone up a long way. Weekly tickets are only up 100%. So anyway, as I, as I do say, I'm not much of a financial expert. I look at that and any green numbers always make me feel happy. So what is the plan for now? Well, probably need to do, hope we do, probably want to get a few more staff in. So all of our bus drivers have been complaining. We only have 175 bus drivers in our main depot. And that's really probably not enough. So let's get a few more bus drivers in. Again, what we're looking for is anyone friendly. Skill level is unimportant. And we will just go until we have enough. So let's do this. Okay, so that should now have boosted our numbers up to a nice round 200. So we have six mechanics. I think we probably want to get a couple more mechanics. As we have four bays, we might as well have a few more of them working in there. So again, we just want cheap, friendly. I don't know why friendly really matters for mechanic. They're working, shouting away. So you're cheap, so you can work and pick up your skill level. And who else do we want? We'll get one more. We'll go for you, uh, Jezzy, because you are very cheap, you're friendly, and your skill will pick up in a bit. Work schedule for mechanics, uh, number of employees present during non-core hours. Let's do four and four, we should have eight. So that's enough for each working in the bays. Actually, no, we'll do... We'll do... Th no, we'll do, four. we'll do four and four. Let's just leave it at that, nice and simple. No messing around. Easy peasy. I'm going to buy a couple more replacement parts. I think we do have some coming, so we'll just get like two or three of each ones that I think will be useful. And we'll just go from there and I just hope that there's enough room for everything in our storerooms. We do have plenty of buses, so hopefully we'll use up all those spare parts nice and quick and then speed things up have it again look at broken buses we have eight of them now i think you own new ones so i'll just run through these again and we will be pushing through to the end of the day and we'll have to have a look and see how we do down here in just a moment okay probably time to get our um our schedule sorted out we only have 53 seconds before we start having issues so let's do this, assign these all up. Let's get our new drivers working and all of our buses going. Oh, we have a few here that we couldn't get out. Quickly pause it and I'll be back in a moment once they are all assigned up somewhere. Okay, that has all of those sorted out. Took a bit of a shift shuffling around, but there we go, done it. However, 
it does appear that our shift cancellation hasn't changed at all. It is still on the exact same 6, which is very strange. You'd thought it would go up or down a little bit. It's been that way now for three days in a row. Maybe that's a good sign that we've not had any go on in the last three days. And come the end of today, maybe it'll all be done. You are smoking away. Have you got your repairs incoming? Yes, you have. Happy days. Have you got your repairs incoming as you're smoking away? No, no you don't. There we go. What I'm going to do is just quickly send a few of these through to get painted up while they're, while they're hanging around. So we'll just come through and see what we can find that needs a quick paint job. These three here could do with a painty too. I think that's all of the buses that need painting up. I mean, these need painting up at some point too, but that will wait another time. Okay, that should have all of the buses sort of sorted out. Um, I've went through and fixed up a few, went through the broken ones, numbered them up and got them painted. So everything is now nice and consistent in our fleet other than our white buses over here, but we'll get them sorted out at some point soon. Let's see how our buses are getting on at the moment in the city. We have a few busy-ish services going around, but nothing too bad for half six in the morning. So let's see, do we have anyone up here really busy in Clanelli or Gore Simmons? It's unlikely. They don't they never seem to get quite as busy as some of the other services. But that said, you and AM30B, you are looking very busy. So let's go through and see if we can chuck on another 30, another 30B. Do we have another bus we can just insert in over here? Yes, we do. Happy days. Got you all kitted up on that one. Do we have anything else that's looking busy? I'm going to probably guess at this point, not too much. I mean, there's a few going around. I think it looks like the ones are busy as always. So maybe I should just chuck another one on the one. Yeah, the one is looking fairly busy and so is the number eight. We'll put a bus on both of them actually, and then we'll just leave it for now. So a number eight looking busy there. Insert additional bus. Do we have a bigger one than one of those? Out you go. And we'll just have a quick scroll through, see if anyone here is looking particularly stressed up. Well, the Craig 45 is looking very, very, very busy. Maybe I should chuck another bus on there, but I'm not sure I can be bothered. I don't think it actually gets us any more money. A 30C is looking busy. Yeah, we'll put another one on the 30C. That does tend to be a fairly, a fairly well used service. So one more on there won't hurt at all. Do we have anyone else? Keep things plodding along. Nice and steady. The Swansea's are busy, but we'll leave those for now. Um, yeah, I think everyone is moving along very nicely. It's just the Craig that's full to the brim. Oh, a 52A, that was amber for a bit. Maybe we'll just chuck another bus in on one of those. Um, there we go. And how are the ones looking? Is still, still very busy. And we have over here a, what are you, a 7. Yeah, put a bus on a 7, why not? It's not, it's not looking busy there, but maybe, I mean, it's not making it that much money, but there we go, another bus on there. That's got those all sorted for now. What messages do we have? An Upper Calais, uh, some changes as of tomorrow. So the current first ride's at 102, so now we're going to 202. That's fine, hunky dory, we can live with all of that. I have just realized that pumping out these buses 
filling in busy services. It's going to help with 198,000. I don't know why that hadn't crossed my mind before. It should have been pretty obvious thinking about it really. But anyway, that should hopefully help and we should hopefully get a lot more buses in over there. Not buses in, a lot more passengers in on our services. Anyway, we have our new office area over here and it's looking fairly good as long as I just come in for this section here. We don't want to go down too far. But yeah, that's looking all right. We have a few more bays to fill in, a couple more bathrooms so people shouldn't be queuing too long um, and all the other good stuff that everyone likes, like kitchens and vending machines. This is probably where we're going to end the episode. We have some money to play around with in the next one. We've got lots of people buying tickets. That's say that constant stream coming in and out, which is always nice to see. And lots of buses looking very busy out here as well. Um, actually, there's a lot more buses looking very busy out over here. What are you? A number 10. It's not often those that get really busy. Um, we've got a 10. All the ones out over here, like the Swansea, a 7, a 17. So we can probably chuck another bus on those quickly. And while I do that, we will wrap everything up and leave it, leave it for this episode. So I'll see you again in the next episode very soon, when hopefully we can be carrying on with putting in more buses. That is the next thing that we need to get sorted. Um, We'll probably need to buy some buses and go spend some of the money that we have lying around at the moment. So we have quite a quite a pile of it forming. Hopefully adding in a few more buses will chivvy us along to getting this 198 and that sweet, sweet 165k that comes with it. But until then, enjoy the rest of your week. I hope you all had a good weekend and I'll see you again in the next episode. Ciao for now.